bored by doing warm-ups on your piano or any instrument with always the same scales, the same exercises. Let's talk about that. Hi, I'm Frank and I'm here to help you to be a successful musician. In this video, I want to share a little thing that I've been using uh, for the last weeks, a little, yeah, little trick that I want to share. So it's very simple, is to warm up or to practice even um, on your instrument, on the piano, our keyboard, on the guitar, with some music. Uh, it can be a song, it can be a background music, it can be a backing track, so that's what I, I was using now. And do that and try to play, just, yeah. You know, I'm going on YouTube, for instance, I just start the music and then... So you see, I was just practicing a scale, in fact, but with some music. So what are the benefits of doing this? Well, first, it's less boring <laughs> than just doing the warm-up exercises. Well, let's be honest, sometimes it's, it's boring. So you can have some fun, so it's always good music. It's also about having fun, right? The second benefit is that it will cultivate your musicality because maybe some of you won't agree and might even get mad at me but really if you just practice techniques like scales, exercises, arpeggio, whatever well you will be a, a technician on your instrument whatever the instrument you choose you might be a very good technician but doesn't really make you a musician. Techniques are made to, as a tool, to express something. Music is about expressing emotions, sadness, joy, whatever. But if you just do technique, well, you don't express so much. So don't get me wrong on that. Techniques are very important. If you don't have any technique, you don't express anything. So you are not a musician as well. Huh? If you just do, uh, do that, yeah, okay, you won't go f very far. So, of course, practice your technique, be good at your technique, learn new techniques. It's, it's very uh, important, but it's the foundation of any musician. So, the thing is that you need to know how to use these techniques or tools in the context of a song, in, of any piece of music. If you practice with a background music, with a backing track, you, you will cultivate that. You will get used to play your scales, for instance, with some music. So you will uh, use some rhythm. You will Basically, you will really grow your musicality, your musical skills by doing this. Because it's like you are part of a song, in a way. So that's why I really encourage you to try that um, for your next practice sessions, for maybe one week, two weeks. Try that at home on your instrument, guitar, piano, whatever. And, and let me know in the comments um, what you think about that. You can maybe just use that as a warm-up, if you wish. So, for instance, I've, yeah, I've been using, using this trick uh, in the last two weeks, mostly on the guitar, playing a backing track and then warming up on that. It's quite, it's quite good and, and quite fun. After, you can work your exercises, your scales, with a metronome, the usual stuff. But 
maybe just as a warm up to yeah you know to have your fingers uh, move in the move uh, try that and yeah let me know so that was my little trick for today i hope you find it interesting and helpful and i will see you in the next video